Gab and I had been writing a whole bunch, and we finally finished this song. And uh, it was written about two really important moments in my life happening at the same time. It was about losing someone I loved and having to say goodbye to them, and not quite knowing how to deal with that, because it was the first time I'd ever had to actually do that. And also falling in love for the very first time and finally understanding what the songs meant, like what love was. And those two feelings of loving someone so much, but one being the beginning and one being the end. And one night we were sat, we had a little writing room at the time we called The Cave. We were sat in the cave, we had all the twinkly lights on and we wrote this song and we realized that we needed to go and find a good producer. <laughs> and we needed to go and record this because it needed to be done. And uh, that's the whole reason we ended up, we wrote, his, this is the way that we found you, Murray, basically. Gab and I wrote a list of our top 10 favorite albums of all time. And we found the email addresses for the as many producers as we could on the list. Wow. Murray was the only one who replied. <laughs> <laughs> the and default producer. No, it was amazing, because it was like, I, I remember the first time you messaged me back and I literally ran around the house screaming and I was like, he knows I'm, it. I'm alive, he knows I exist. <laughs> and um, I just couldn't believe it. We got on the Skype call. I don't know if I even told you this. I was also like, to my wife, I was like, Somebody from England just <laughs> contacted me about producing. <laughs> we were so excited, and we got on the Skype call just to talk to you about ideas. And at the end of the Skype call, I hung up, I booked flights to Winnipeg, and then I called my band. I was like, you guys, we're going to Canada in January. Cancel work. They are like, Always what have you done? <laughs> um, and then I called you back and was like, hey, by the way, you're free in January. I just like, I have to go. If this is the only time I ever get to record music in my life, I need it to be this way. And we ended up recording an EP uh, called Unfinished Business. <laughs> if you know the words, please sing along. This is Unfinished Business. You guys too. You be 
And I can't help myself from living in flashbacks Yeah, I sure hope there's more to this Cause you feel Yeah. 